Hello everyone, I am Kranti Das and I am one among this 130 million crores of people in India. Where are we heading towards? Really, where are we heading towards? I am really devastated with the news of Sushant Singh Rajput's death. Not because he's my brother or he's my friend or he's my colleague. No. He's a well-known actor with amazing background. I'm talking about educational background. He might not have a godfather in the industry, but he has, you know, proved himself that he is nothing less than those big stars in the industry today every single person in industry outside the industry and people from different countries are reacting for his death we have to react as much as possible so that we do not lose another Sushant Singh Rajput from any industry just not Bollywood we have been blaming nepotism, but are we not the reason for his death? Why are we not encouraging those actors who has come from small towns with their talents into the industry? Why are we not, uh, you know, watching their movies? In fact, we watch movies of those actors who come from the film industry. We are supporting the nepotism. They might be taking movies of their children, uh, you know, like Karan Johar might in introduce all the big shots, um, children into the movies. But why are we watching those movies? If we are not watching the movies of those stars, definitely they are not making money out of it, right? There are amazing small movies with directed by superb directors with multi-talented and amazing work shown on the screen and superb actors coming from nowhere only due to their talent they're into this industry. We are not encouraging them. So we all are, see, we all are the reason for one's death. We are really not sure he has taken his life because of depression or because he was thinking too much about his mother or maybe any reason. But just think once that what are we up to? Why are we being the reason to, uh, to Bollywood to make so much money? And imagine we are the reason for their success, right? But when that Shah Rukh, Salman or Amitabh Bachchan, when they're in front of you and you go and ask for autograph, do you think they will ever give you? They don't have that much time to give you any autograph. They have bodyguards around. They don't have time to even tell you hello. And we all are the reasons for their you know, success. Right? Think. When someone is dying, we mourn for them and then we post so many social media stuff, um, pictures, videos, every now and then, only for that one week or 10 days and then we forget. And the new case comes and we talk about them. It can be for animal. Recently when an elephant died in Kerala, we were like posting about the death continuously for a week or 10 days and then we completely forgot and then... We, we stopped fighting about that and then we jumped into something else. This is how life goes. I'm not blaming anyone, including me, everyone. We cannot, uh, you know, hold on to something and uh, think about it and stop living our lives, right? But then, where is an end for this kind of, you know, I will never consider this to be a uh, suicide. Because he is an exceptional person. 
he has immense talent he has immense knowledge and he he goes to different colleges and institutes to uh, influence children uh, students why would he take his life i'm sure there might be you know definitely you know it it should be something very strong reason that he couldn't live anymore because he imagined his life to be everything to be in bollywood maybe he thought he doesn't have uh, any future in it maybe he didn't want to go back and live a normal life right so it can be any reason because we all because uh, sushant singh rajput or any person who commit suicide they never leave a note while they are dying they never leave a message to friends while they are dying or at least one or two days before they don't even discuss why they are feeling low this is one of the main symptom of depression they don't express anything they'll keep everything inside them and then one day they are gone guys it is not about one person this is about every single human being we are living with knowing or unknowingly you might hurt someone with your words with your deeds with your work with your you know uh, gestures do not do that you might not like someone but you don't have to be rude with that person these are the things that you can avoid to make the other person feel good about existing on this earth this person has been suffering so much and he's gone we lost such an immense talented actor he he could have worked anywhere not just bollywood because the kind of education background he has the family background he has he would have survived any anywhere but are we not the reason for his death how many of us has seen ms dhoni or chichore or socharya or uh, kai poche oh my god he has done amazing job and we don't we we just you know we admire him for his good looks the kind of shows he does or one serial that he has done pavitra rishta but if you i see thousands of people or millions of people uh, posting about sushant singh rajput but how many of you or how many of us know what all movies he has acted in the reason we do not know because we do not watch we wait for karan johar's movies releases we wait for yash yash uh, chopra's uh, movies or sharukh or salman or amitabh bachchan or alia bhat or ranveer singh or you don't i don't say they are not talented of course they are talented they are act their acting skills are talented alia bhat is talented but when you are encouraging this lady who has immense talent why are we not encouraging sushant singh rajput because he doesn't have a godfather or because he did not born in uh, take birth in the bollywood uh, family yes there are talents in bollywood family too but why are we only supporting them and not the other uh, batch a set of people who don't come from bollywood background and it happens in every every uh, you know tollywood or uh, you know tamil background or malayal i'm not saying just in bollywood even you know coming from a telugu background from andhra pradesh i see in andhra also there are amazing actors no one is coming up because you already have chiranjeevi uh, nagarjuna balakrishna uh, venkatesh these are the actors who are always in the picture we have lost uday kiran an actor some almost 10 years back because of the same issue or many other actors and actresses are dying because they are not getting work today we are fighting for sushant singh rajput from bollywood come on there are so many people in your own industry is just have a look watch movies of those talented actors who doesn't come from the industry but they have two good talent who showcases their uh, you know acting skills 
when you're watching uh, the uh, what do you say the industry people um, high profile actors movies why are you not watching the other set of group of people who are coming from you know with their own talent and not with any godfather see i don't watch movies much but when i watch i make sure i watch the movie which has some sense in it not uh, someone's movie who just run around the bushes this guy has never his interviews are amazing he is not like those uh, varun dhawan or ranveer singh who has this you know notorious kind of um, nonsense that they keep doing in the interviews they don't talk any sense and you enjoy their movies someone who has this much talent man we lost him we can never bring him back before we lose so many such actors it's our duty to watch those movies which has talent and who come from non bollywood or tollywood backgrounds and without any godfather without any help who are only uh, you know coming up with their talent and nothing else we have to support them please my sincere request we all are just assuming lot of things and we are talking about this guy who is no more let's not do that we can if if we really want to mourn for his death or if we really want to do something good uh, after his death is watch movies or encourage those just not movies i'm talking about encourage those people who have talent in them not someone who comes from you know by nepotism nepotism i bollywood or hollywood or tollywood is not encouraging nepotism the public are supporting it by watching those movies where the big shots or actor you know the industry kids are already uh, are acting in the movies we are supporting the nepotism let's not do that and my sincere request let's not write nonsense on uh, the social media because the family already lost their son their brother or their cousin or friend already right now let us not make it more worse by writing nonsense about the death